we do have uh, we have a little game for you. We all have final exams this week, so we decided your final exam would be us you know, kind of quizzing you on some some hip lingo. See if you're really in, in touch with your students. You're so. talking about hip lingo from 1970s, or no? We're, we're, we're talking, talking now. Uh, that's we're talking not going to. Yeah, we're talking. It's going to be right a problem, now. I think. No, no, no. There, give us the give us the little the play in there. All right, Chancellor. <laughs> Here we go. All right, the first one is. I hope is... your finals go better than this. <laughs> Mine probably won't. All right. First word is on fleek. Now you have three options here, okay? Is on fleek achieving an aesthetic goal? B, a type of combat stance utilized in Olympic fencing? Or three, on the new furry dating site, fleek? <laughs> well, that sounds French, so the second one's tempting, but uh, <laughs> no. number three. Number three. Yeah. <laughs> it's A. It's A. It was A, but I, good. I, yeah, no. If, is, if you stay with that pattern, I'll do better. All right. First all right. One, we'll first keep them all A. Yeah. All right. All right. Next one. By the way, don't do that in your multiple choice. No. That, <laughs> should say, I like draw faces with my scantrons. Really cool. <laughs> all right. Next word is lit. Is it A, a truncated form of the word literally, because four syllables is way too many? B, a high energy event or location? Or three, or B, I'm saying A, B, three. Or C, burning your notes at the end of the semester. Well, I went uh, the wrong way. So let me go in the middle this time and go with B. Sir, you are correct. So I'm just, random guessing really does <laughs> work better. You're right? no, shooting 50% from the line right now. That's pretty good. All right, next one. WCW. Is that an acronym for A, Woman Crush Wednesday? B, We're Clearly Wasted? Or C, Wine, Cheese, Wonderful? Well, my bartending days are going to help with this one. I'll have to go with B. be happy. It's Woman Crush Wednesday. <laughs> ah. Ah. We're back to A again. Yeah. All right. This one only has two options, so you got a better chance here. <laughs> I think we probably just had something inappropriate and I decided to accent the last thing. No. All right. Uh, Jeed. Is it A, a person not affiliated with a Greek letter organization? Or B, when you mess up trying to say Jesus and goddamn at the same time? <laughs> Uh, I haven't picked A yet, so I have to go with A. You are correct. <laughs> so you're, you're two for four right now? It's pretty bad. If this one is one choice, though, I'm feeling better. All right. <laughs> I noticed you were lowering the number. Yeah, so. yeah, we'll narrow it down from two. All right. All right, final word, Chancellor Gallagher, is throw in shade. That's, that's two words, yeah. Is throw in shade A? A mispronunciation of throwings had E. <laughs> B, passing that old gypsy curse along to your neighbor. <laughs> it's got to be B. Or C, insulting someone in a passive aggressive manner. There's no phone a friend or anything like that here, right? Uh, I can use it in a song. I don't know what. <laughs> Do you want me to use it in a sentence? I'll, I'll go back to C. C. And he's correct. He went three for five. <laughs>